Have you ever felt ignored by someone who seems to care for others? This question might seem perplexing, but it's a common quandary when dealing with a covert narcissist. You see, covert narcissists are masters of disguise. They possess an uncanny ability to appear selfless while subtly manipulating situations to fulfill their own needs. In this video, we delve into the mind of a covert narcissist. We explore 10 possible reasons why they might ignore your needs while seemingly attending to others. From maintaining an altruistic facade to setting the stage for future payback, these individuals employ a myriad of tactics to serve their self-interest while projecting an image of selflessness. It's a perplexing and often painful reality for those in their orbit, but remember these are just possible reasons. The narcissist's specific motivations might vary depending on the situation and their personality. So let's begin our journey into understanding the covert narcissist's world. Firstly, covert narcissists crave admiration and recognition for their kindness. But let's delve a little deeper into this. They are masters of disguise, often appearing selfless, charitable and compassionate. But why? It's because they've learned that helping others allows them to project an image of selflessness. This altruistic facade is a carefully crafted mask they wear to deflect attention from their own desires. Think of it like a smoke and mirrors act, where the smoke is their seemingly altruistic actions and the mirror is the covert narcissist themselves. This act of helping others serves a dual purpose. On one hand, it feeds their ego as they bask in the admiration and recognition that comes with their acts of kindness. On the other hand, it shifts focus away from their own needs and desires, which they subtly manipulate situations to fulfill. In other words, their seemingly selfless acts are often just a way to maintain an altruistic facade. Secondly, covert narcissists often use a technique called triangulation. This is a masterful manipulation tactic where they pit people against each other, creating a whirlwind of drama and chaos. By ignoring your needs and attending to others, they stoke the fires of insecurity and competition. This not only diverts attention away from their own selfish desires, but also gives them a sense of power and control. But the manipulation doesn't stop there. They also project a martyr complex, painting themselves as the overburdened hero. They appear to sacrifice their own well-being for the benefit of others. This portrayal is a clever ruse designed to garner sympathy and admiration. It's a way for them to craft a narrative that they are selfless, when in reality they are anything but. So ignoring your needs not only strengthens their narrative of being a martyr, but also gives them a sense of power. So next they might use neglect as a form of punishment. When you dare to assert your needs or challenge their behavior, a covert narcissist may retaliate. They might withhold attention or care, subtly punishing you for daring to question their actions. This is a technique designed to control, to keep you in a state of uncertainty, always second-guessing your own perceptions. Now let's shift our focus to empathy, or rather the lack thereof. Covert narcissists often struggle with genuine empathy. They may put on a show of being caring and attentive, especially when they're in the spotlight. They might volunteer at the local shelter or offer to help a friend in need. But scratch beneath the surface and you'll find their empathy is often superficial. It serves a purpose to maintain their altruistic facade to keep the admiration and validation flowing their way. While they might appear caring towards others, it's often superficial and their true focus remains on themselves. Fifth, they might exploit your empathetic nature. It's a cunning strategy, really. Covert narcissists often target individuals with a high degree of empathy, preying on their instinct to help others. They may guilt trip you into prioritizing others' needs, making you feel selfish for considering your own. This tactic serves a dual purpose. It ensures their needs are met while simultaneously making you neglect your own. But it doesn't stop there. These manipulators have a knack for keeping you off balance. They might create situations where you're constantly second-guessing yourself, trapped in a cycle of trying to meet their ever-changing expectations. This preoccupation with their manipulations prevents you from seeing the larger picture, their control over the relationship dynamic. They subtly steer the course of interactions, decisions, and even your emotions, all while maintaining an innocent facade. In essence, they use your empathy against you to maintain control. Their exploitation of your empathy isn't a reflection on your weakness, but a testament to their manipulation. Sixth, they might ignore your needs to protect their fragile ego. 
You see, covert narcissists harbor a deep-seated sense of superiority. They believe they're above others, and acknowledging your needs would mean admitting they're not. If your needs challenge their grandiose self-image or require them to genuinely consider your feelings, they might withdraw. This withdrawal isn't out of indifference, but rather a desperate attempt to avoid feeling vulnerable. Now let's turn the lens towards their insecurities. Yes, beneath that veneer of arrogance, many narcissists grapple with profound insecurity. Meeting your needs might expose their own limitations or inadequacies. So ignoring you in a twisted way protects their self-image and inflated sense of importance. It's a shield, a buffer against the harsh reality that they're not as invincible as they'd like to believe. Their neglect is thus a defense mechanism to protect their ego and hide their insecurities. Lastly, they might ignore your needs now to set the stage for future payback. The covert narcissist's game is one of strategy and patience. They're not just thinking about the present moment, but also the future, meticulously setting up a scenario where they're in a position of power. By ignoring your needs and focusing on others, they're essentially making an investment, an investment where they expect significant returns. Imagine this scenario. They've been ignoring you but have been lavishly attentive to others. Then one day they need a favor, a compliment or validation. They'll remind you of all the times they've helped others, subtly implying that it's your turn to return the favor. They've created an indebtedness, a sense of obligation, and now they're cashing in on it. This is their masterstroke, their end game, the payback they've been setting up for. They've successfully manipulated the situation to their advantage while maintaining an image of selflessness. It's a complex, intricate dance, one that requires a keen understanding and careful navigation. But let's remember the key points we've discussed today. Covert narcissists are skilled manipulators. Their actions are not a reflection of your worth, but a testament to their need for control and validation. It's crucial to protect your well-being in such situations. Setting boundaries is paramount. It's okay to say no, to prioritize your needs. You're not being selfish, you're simply taking care of yourself. It's also important to seek support, whether from friends, family or professionals. You're not alone in this. Remember, their motivations may vary and their tactics can be diverse and complex. It's not about blaming yourself, but understanding their behavior and developing strategies to cope. In conclusion, the world of a covert narcissist is a labyrinth of manipulation and control. It's a challenging journey navigating through it, but with knowledge, understanding and self-care, you can protect yourself and reclaim your power. Don't blame yourself for their behavior. Consider seeking professional guidance to understand their tactics and develop strategies for coping with a covert narcissist.